technique. It's right in the center, so 30, 40. All right, save the results of today's trip. All right, let's return to the lab. Are you gonna give me what I want? Welcome back. Welcome back. Here's something to make your search for Pokemon signs easier. Wouldn't it be great if Zero One moved faster? Well, now you can use this dash engine if you wanna go faster. It's easy to use, press R to make the Zero One move faster. No, I'm good. First of all, see the Pokemon sign page. All right, so that wasn't the item that I was particularly hoping for, but uh, let's head to the beach yes. and we'll start taking pictures of the Pokemon signs since that is available for me. All right, what do we got? There, there, there. And then we get closer to the, the, the Doduo. No, I knocked out Pikachu. That's gonna make things harder for me. Get, get on. I can make it go faster, but I can't make it stop. All right, that's as good as I'm gonna get there. It's important that I go this way. All right, I got a Pokemon sign there. That was supposed to be a, a Krabby or a Kingler. I've never been entirely sure. Um, let's go a little bit faster here. Try to hit the Meowth then. Okay, should be able to get a good pose on the other side. All right, try to get the Scyther then. Yeah, I've never been able to figure out a pattern to the Scyther. And then he just flies away. Like, I can't get a good shot of him that way. Uh, then there's Pikachu over here, um, but I can't I can't make him do what I want, so we're gonna leave them alone. But we got the Pokemon sign. That's the important part here. Uh, we'll just kind of go until the Pidgey stops us. And away they go. Fancy shots. Can't get a good EV from there. Um, let's hit you. All right, then we can speed up past these Pidgey, and uh, we can just kind of go. No need to to really do anything more here for the time being. Uh, once you get to the part where the the door kind of opens for you, you're pretty much done. All right, so let's see what we got this time. All right, three pictures of Pidgey. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna see if this is better than the Gust one. All right, that's a closer picture of Dodo Duo. So we'll see here. I think that first one's the best. That Pikachu. All right, so. There you can kind of see that it's supposed to be a, a Krabby or a Kingler, but basically it's the Pokemon sign. And that is what he was after, after all. That's a closer Snorlax. Uh, this pose that we get from Meow, that's what we're looking for. The size is a little off, but that's all right. All right, I think that's the one we want for Scyther. Uh, Chansey, you know what? I think it's this first one. Okay. Now, what can I do with the Kangaskhan? I already got a really good Kangaskhan picture. I'm gonna say that one. I like that kind of pose to it. Let's go to Professor Oak. Yes. And we'll see what we can get here. All right, Pidgey. 480. Pose is just a thousand. Technique is good. So yeah, it's not as good as Gust using Pidgey. Not even close. Which is what I kind of thought, but that was worth checking. All right, 480, 350. Why is the pose not good? He's not like landing the jump. All right, Surfing Pikachu gets a thousand. Size is 370. Pose is 1250. Technique, not gonna save me. All right, first one it is. 
Snorlax? I feel like this is a better Snorlax. Yep, it sure is. Well done. 3420. Meowth, I hope this one's better. 820, better there. I thought the pose was going to be over a thousand there. Either way, it's still a better picture. Scyther, we'll do what we can with Scyther. Oh, this is a fighting pose, 1300, that's what I thought. All right, technique well done. is much better. There we go, 2200 more points. We have Chansey, and not, not as good. Not as good. Kangaskhan, let's see. Size, 970. Pose, it's not going to be as good. I pretty much have a perfect Kangaskhan picture. I don't think I can top that. Oh, oh this is Pokemon sign I've been looking for. Wonderful, your work is impeccable. Keep up the good work. Okay. Wait. Let's return to the lab. Are you going to give me what I want? Welcome back. You take pictures at good pace to make your work easier. Here's a present for you. It'll come in handy for taking Pokemon pictures. Would you like to see rare Pokemon poses? Pay this Poke Flute to make it happen. It's easy to use. The down C button allows you to play Poke Flute. You can listen. All right, I don't know how to do that. Uh, we're gonna redo the beach course as a result yes. of getting the Poke Flute. That's important. Um, how do I do? Okay. So it's down on the stick, down on the right stick. All right, so then we get uh, Pikachu and like that. And it's just kind of autumn, always going, which is nice. Um, no, it just goes for a while, huh? So here's a better shot of uh, the Krabby. There you go. But we don't need that picture anymore. It keeps on changing the camera when I do that, though. Alright, so we can get, like, a dancing Snorlax if you pay the, play the Poke Flute. So we want to keep on playing the Poke Flute. All right, there's the Scyther. More important thing is that the Pikachus come out. And if you play the Poke Flute with the Pikachus here, they'll they'll do their uh, their attack there. Keep on playing. I'm not done here. Yeah. And we can stop you there. Okay, so if I play the Poke Flute and ignore Chansey and Eevee, over here, if I've done it properly, should be a much closer Lapras than that. It was supposed to be like right there. I thought that was the trick. All right, I think we're done here. Thought that was the trick for it. I might have to start looking up some, some of the tricks for some of the Pokemon. This is going off of memories from like when did this game come out? 99? This is almost 20 years old now that I'm trying to remember this stuff. It's been a while. But I'm trying. Alright. Uh, Pidgey, I don't care about the Do Duo. I'm going to try again. Uh, electrocuting Pikachu. I'll try from there. That's a pretty nice shot. Uh, that's apparently a Butterfree shot. All right, we're going to say that one's the best Snorlax. The other ones are going to be too close. Uh, we're going to do a mean face Meowth, see if that that's good for something. Um, we'll do the original Scyther there. 
three pictures of Lapras, it's just not good enough. Like, you can get a much better shot of Lapras. All right. Go to Professor Oak, then. All right, this is Doduo. Let's see, 490. Oh, the pose is still bad. I have to get him, like, as soon as he lands. And the tech... What are you saying it wasn't in the middle? All right, size, 580, pose. The pose zaps even me, 1,300 points. Technique is not going to save it. Balloon Pikachu was much better off then. All right, Snorlax, 730, a little bit better. Pose, oh, what a jolly dance, 1,200 points. Technique times two, well done. 3860. All right, Meowth, 730, pose is 1,000. We just can't seem to uh, get higher than a thousand there on the meow. All right, size is 350. What? The pose isn't good. I thought that was a fighting pose. Looks like one to me. All right, Lapras. It's not as good as my last one. That first one that I took. All right, if you collect all the Pokemon signs, you'll be able to enter the secret course. Uh, but you know what? I th I've been going for a while. I've been going for a long while. Let's go ahead and save my progress. We will pick up from here next time. Um, I thought this was going to take about four hours. It might not take all of that, but uh, we are uh, well within the range of um, being able to, to finish this next time. And we'll take it on next time. I hope you guys have enjoyed these parts of Pokemon Snap. I'm Baller Scoop. I've been joined as always by a kind of creepy Professor Oak and uh, many, many Pokemon. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.